transfer deadline day is here. And we've got some news. Um, well, Barisic, we'll talk about Barisic first of all, because that's the major, right? That doesn't look like it's happening. Yesterday, and obviously we've seen the the, like the, the old firm game, he was getting the crowd hyped up, k kissing the pitch and on, he was in tears. So everyone thought he was away, Chris Boyd. I mean, I kind of thought, you know, but looks like that deal's fell through. There's nothing actually on BBC about it, because they're not going to report on that shit. But obviously, yes, I mean, there probably will be more news, to be honest, um, throughout the day, and I'll make more fids on it, so I'm not going to make this fid particularly, like, you know, 8 minutes or whatever, 10 minutes, or 5 minutes even, <laughs> don't know how long I'll make it, but, I mean, if you want to see any, like, because obviously you load, if you're not aware, right, check out Fog Football, that is, we literally, all football, and, well, I say all football, it's more or less just Scottish football, obviously here, it's just the, it's the Rangers show, um, the best way it should be, but, you know, Fog Football, we'll talk about everything. I mean, John Sutter, Edward uh, is away for big money. Christy looks like he's away. Um, shit like that. Matty Longstaff, that guy I know, big man. We've also got Cedric getting here, though. Uh, Ranger Striker, he's joined Griffer, fourth on loan. You look at that team, you assume, hmm, Bundesliga free. No, they're actually a Bundesliga club. They, I think they just recently um, got promoted. And you know what? I have no problem with this because I like getting, but it. it it's just never really worked out, you know, and um, I guess that's just the bottom line, to be perfectly honest. And we've also, I mean, we've got Roof, with Morelos, with Defoe, with Sakala, with Wright, with Kent, Haji, all in that front area. Do we really need it? And, you know, probably not. And, I, you know, if the worst came to the worst, there's always January. Or maybe there's an option to recall him, but I really hope. He succeeds. I really hope he goes here and fucking outscores Lewandowski and comes back next season, man, you know, and lays the smack down, but we never really know. Also, though, Katic looks like he could potentially be moving out on loan. The Hasduck split that team, brother. Um, he's only been capped once by his country, and he's only recently returned for a long-term knee injury, of course, but he's not featured so far this season, so it'll be interesting to see if... Um, that goes out, guys. But obviously, these are just loans. But mo more importantly, we don't want Barisic to go, and it doesn't really look like that he is going. But anyway, guys, I'll do it for this quick fed. We'll take a quick look here. Um, I like transfer. It's a shame. You look at you look at like transfer deadline day in total, like well in general. I mean, you see Ronaldo going to United. And you look at the Scott, like, up here, it is, it's a wee bit demoralising, we're never going to be able to make signings like that, you know? Like, like I'm not, I'm never expecting this to bring in, like, a Ronaldo, but I would just like the fucking, the money situation to get a bit better, but we can, you know, Rangers and Celtic can go out and spend, like, 30 million, like, 30 million, see in today's market, it's fuck all, like, but this is never, that's never going to happen. The most it's ever going to get, for me, for a Scottish club to spend, it'll be about 15, honestly, I, I don't, I don't see it happening maybe in about 10 years time we'll get a tv deal and that will I'll, I'll be rang but who knows who knows guys but anyway leave your thoughts down below till next time peace